This is Benjamin Ingram in Dallas, Texas. Um, thanks for inviting me to be part of this very powerful message that you're sending to dads everywhere. So yeah, keep up the good work. Um, introductions. This is my 24-year-old son. His name is Gabriel. He's a staff sergeant in the Air Force, currently on deployment, um, standing behind me. Hey, Brandon. It's my 19-year-old daughter. She is a student at West Point. So my message for the day, or tip for the day for dads everywhere, stay in the game. You know what I'm talking about. Um, you got your favorite sport, you got your favorite team, and you know what it's like when your team pulls it out in the fourth quarter or in the fourth period or in the last game of the series. Forget about it. Golden State's going to win. So, you know. What you don't understand is that same thing applies to you as a dad. Sometimes you don't feel like you're doing a good job. You don't understand why you have to do the things that you do. You just fed them at lunch, they're hungry again at dinner. Point is, you stay in the game. You keep doing the things that you're doing. You go to the PTA meetings. You pack the lunch for them and send them a note. You know, you walk them to school and sometimes pick them up from school. You, you show up and let the teachers see that face, see that they're, they're, that child has a dad. You know, help them with their homework. Stay in the game. And even when you feel like you're losing, when you feel like that there's no way that you're getting through to this kid, <laughs> fourth period, fourth quarter comes around and you win. Not only do you win, but you're helping your kids to win. You're sending a message to them, a generational precedent to them that this is what they saw their dad do, now that's what they're gonna do for their kids. So my message for the day, just stay in the game.